Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Border Collie Adventures. It's been a couple of weeks, I know. It's been a bit slow. I have done a few videos, but wasn't really impressed with them, so I decided not to post them. So we'll leave those in the bin. So me and Paddy, I hey, buddy, are on the way to Namphilo Woods in near Falmouth. Uh, just for something different really. We did go up to Tintagel the other day, like I said, did a video up there, but again, wasn't too impressed with it. This is Paddy's first time actually riding up front with me. He's doing alright at the minute actually, he seems to be enjoying it. I think. But I had to put a sheet on on mummy's seat because you get that covered in hair and slobber and dribble she's not gonna be too impressed with me is she hey. he's hiding out of camera and, you know, i don't know if any of you can see him over there hey. hi buddy he's, he's sort of <laughs> oh no now he's led down paddy i need i kind of need the gear stick yeah i do i need the gear stick now he's resting on my hand can... i love you too mate but not really helping me right now. I need to, to kind of drive the car over there. Let's see. Yeah, got my hand back. So yeah, we're heading to Nanfilo Woods. I've never been there before. I don't know what to expect. I don't know where I'm going, to be fair. I'm gonna have to get it up on the maps in a minute. And then we'll see you guys when we get to the woods. Cheers. So guys, we finally made it to Nanfilo Woods. I believe it's Nanfilo Woods because the sat nav took me to Trillisic Gardens, so which is a lovely garden part of the National Trust, but it was the wrong place, obviously. Someone's eager to go. I'm going to go walking. You in the woods? Yeah. The other reason I had him in the front was actually because I haven't actually tested out his um his seatbelt, which actually works really, really well. But Mummy called us when we were on the way. And I might have told her that Paddy was in the front. Didn't I? But you've got to go in the back. So Paddy's got to go back there on the way home. I don't think he's very impressed. Is he? <laughs> oh, someone's keen to go. Right, we're going to get out of the car and head to the woods. So this, this is the entrance. Never been here before. Paddy's already peeing. Come on in. Literally the road is literally just there. So, yeah. And I didn't bring my boots. Oh well, never mind. I'm gonna leave Paddy on the lead for a minute because obviously I've never been here before. And I don't want to just assume that I can I can let him off. So he's currently just chilling on the lead and having a good sniff. Are you coming? Come on. Good boy. It's very, very wet and muddy. But we did, we did a walk last week. And uh, Paddy had his first up close encounter with horses, didn't you, mate? Which went actually quite well. He was he was rather intrigued. He didn't bark or or growl or anything. Whereas when he's had horses come past him in the past, and I've took him out the way, he sort of had a bit of a grumble. But it's nice. And then literally, as you go. So, Paddy, that was naughty. So my dog has just rolled in horse shit. <laughs> Excuse my language. But down that way is you go to the King Harry Ferry, which is own, owned, last time I knew it was owned by a bloke called Tim Light. And my dog has now got horse crap down him. That was naughty, Paddy. 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 Yeah, you naughty boy. 
so I'm going to walk on a bit further and I'll bring you guys back soon when I've decided to let young Padwan off the lead. I shall see you in a bit, guys. So he is now off the lead. I'm trying to wait until I get to a nice viewing bit. Let's show you guys a nice picturesque day, even though it's drizzling right now. It is nice. It's nice and it's chill. It's not, I wouldn't say it was cold. It's quite cool, but you peeing on absolutely everything you are. It's nice. It's little characteristic bits. It's really nice trees. I said, guys, I've never been here before. Probably just scared the pheasant. But I have no idea where this goes. Paddy, I'm busting for a wee. He's like, yeah, Dad, I can go wherever I like. Yeah, lucky you. God, it smells down here. Paddy, have you farted? It certainly smells like it. Oh, what's he spotted? I'm going to put him on the leader set because, like I said, I'm a bit nervous being in a new place with him. So. Come on, bum bum. Hi. Hey, let's go. You find me a stick? Here, what's this? You want a sticky stick? You want a stick? You want a stick? Ready? Oh, this is really nice. I'm glad I found... Come, come here, to be fair. Hey. Funky trees. Lots of um, birds up in the trees as well, actually, which is, which is nice. It's more from the Cobra Valley, where I normally walk in. It's really nice. Hey, buddy. Hey? Yeah, you're going in the boot on the way home, because I've just spoke to Mummy again. Because you rolled in horse poo. <laughs> I suppose it's better than fox poo, because fox poo really stinks. Hey, let's go. Oh, I don't know what it is. I just feel more... I just noticed that you can see my, um, I'll move that out of the way. <laughs> you can see my tripod. I feel more, I don't know, it's nicer here. Like, more connected to the, to the woods here than the ones in Helston. Like Paddy's not got anywhere to swim, but. It is nicer though. I like these little little pathways that go down into the, the woodland and stuff. You having fun, mate? Hey, you having fun? Yeah. He seems to be really enjoying it. Off camera, he's bouncing around like a right loony. I think he's tired himself out a little bit now. I don't think there's much viewing area this way. But, um, yeah, it's a really nice place. Hi, morning. Go on. I didn't really, I didn't record any of the drive here because the traffic was just stupid. Because it is quarter to six so it is is rush hour so traffic was slow you know just been boring so and plus Alex is normally the one that um that does the filming while we're moving hence why I only literally did the introduction and that was it I'm done 
there's plenty of horse tracks along this way, so I'm hoping I don't bump into any by paddies off the lead. But he should be okay. He's normally pretty good. Normally he just goes to the ground and just like, Ooh. I'll have to try and get him on the lead. Uh, oh, Paddy, this way, please. There's a gate right there with the road on the other side. I'll just grab him on the lead a sec and I'll be back with you. Paddy, come here. Well, I've got the gate there. Paddy here. Come here. And then this side, right here. So, I think it's time for this. Paddy, can you come this way, please? Come here for me. Sit down. Sit down. Paddy. Sit. You little bugger. Sit. Thank you. Right, this way. We'll go back this way because obviously I don't know. There's a pathway going up there. Or should we just go that way? Should we just go that way? Let's just go this way. Or do we? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm being indecisive right now. Um, I'm not really sure. Do we want to go this way? Paddy? Well, Paddy seems to be pulling me this way, so... Alright, well, we'll go this way then. Might look like he's pulling me, but he's not actually. There's not much, much tension there. Ooh, what's this, buddy? Oh, it's a field. Um, okay. Uh, I'm not sure now. Um, right, we'll go back. We'll go back this way. In places I'm unsure, guys. I'm just. You know, I'd probably say I'm a bit overcautious, which, you know, in unknown places, probably isn't a bad thing, because you don't know what, what kinds of trouble that I can get into, or the dog can get into, and it's not something that we want. Is it, Bum Bum? Me? Eh? Eh. Now you know, don't you? He knows when he's on the lead that, you know, something's, something's up, or something. Something's happening and it needs to be needs to be controlled a little bit. Right, you can come off now because we're back in this bit. Come here. Sorry guys, I've got to put one of my headbands on and it's frustrating me. Oh, that metal bit was cold. Put the lead over over my shoulders. That oh, was cold. <laughs> Sorry. Poor filming right now. Oh, hey, side tongue. How you doing? What are you barking at? Go on. Out of there. You know what I mean? He's nuts. Go! Where are you going? Where's you going? Where are you going, buddy? Huh? Huh? Go find them. Go find them. Go find them. Find them. You find them. Go find them. Go on. Go on. Go find him, go find him. God, I wish I had his energy. <laughs> come out of there, please. There's a drop down there. Paddy, come here, please. Good boy. You good boy? 
Give me your dirty tongue. What? Where is it? Go find them. Oh, jeez. Hey. Sit down. Hey. Say hi, guys. Hey, everyone. I've been a good boy. Yeah, right. You're never a good boy. Except all the time. Go on. No, he's really not a good boy all the time. <laughs> He's a poo most of the time. Come on in. Woo! <laughs> you alright, mate? Hmm? Yeah, Uncle Paul's watching. And Auntie Katie. They are. They'll be watching. What's on? Go find him. In that case. So we are heading back the way we came, obviously, as you guys know. We're gonna if we get down the end, there's a pathway that goes down the hill, so I don't know. Maybe go and have a look at that. Come on! That's it, you run it out. Run all that energy out. Go on. Even though it's probably going to take him days to days of running to do it. Paddy, come up there. Come up. Ooh. Funky looking mushrooms. You stay away from them, please. Oh, and you get poorly. Go on. Very bright orange. Ready? Come up. Here he comes. Hi. Don't jump. We're going to go down the hill now. Yeah? Come on then, let's go. So, we're back here. Now we're going downhill. Oh, this is quite steep. <laughs> Really nice. I just don't want to slip over. You're all right. You've got four legs. You've got like twice the grip. Ain't yeah. Hey. I have no idea where this goes. <laughs> like, no. I'm hoping it goes down by the water. That would be really pretty to look at. It's like a little sort of like drainage thing here. Yeah. It goes off there. Um, that's a cool tree. Oh, 
Come on, you. Oh. Paddy, come on. Nobody wants to see that, Bobby. It's quite a steep hill, isn't it? Right, let's just sort that out a sec. We'll just, just come down the hill. What's this? Obviously, you can walk that way, but. Um, and Paddy's decided he's gone this way, so I guess we'll get him this way. Oh, there he is. Come on, then. Well, as long as it doesn't affect the dog. I'm sure if it did, they would have put it on the sign, so... I'm quite happy for him to still run around. Wow. Oh, I can hear water. There's a little stream over there by the sounds of it. Let's go and have a look. Oh, Paddy, careful. Let me up me over there. Oh, yeah. Tiny little stream. Don't you be going in that because it's filthy. This way, uh, young man, now I told you not to. But keeping you out of water is like trying to keep a duck out of the bloody water, isn't it? Come on. You told you not to. Oh. Gee, very grey. Very, very grey today. I know I'm not talking very much today, guys, but it's a place I've never been. I actually really like it. I think you might have to walk down here a little bit more often. If you'd like to see that, guys, make sure you leave a thumbs up and a comment. Don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell as well. That helps me massively. I'm up to 702 so far. I'd like to hit 1,000 by the end of the year. That would be great. Just listen. I don't know if you can hear the pigeon, wood pigeon. I know it's not um yeah, particularly clean. I say clean, it's not um yeah, piles of wood everywhere. It's nice. Paddy seems to be really enjoying himself, which is good. He doesn't get to visit new places as often as I'd like. But he's, um, he's enjoying it today. That's for certain. I'm enjoying it too, to be fair. I should have gone this way to start with. Guys, I am struggling to plan a, a biggish video. It's, it's finding the right time to do it, the right place, taking the right stuff. Because I did buy a um a bed. Paddy, can you get out of that, please? There's a bog, and I don't want you getting my car filthy, even though you are going in your, your crate in the boat on the way back. But, um, but uh, yeah, I did buy a um. A bed for the back of the car which i think was in one of my previous videos yeah it was the one that was camp and cook fail that was it um and uh, we went to wales and i slept in the car with the dog and my partner slept in the, uh, the caravan with my 
mother and father in law and, and the child. And it popped. <laughs> Which is amazing. Um, it's only a tiny hole, so it's easily fixable. But I just don't think. I think if I want to do it, if I'm going to do it, it's going to be a camp job in a tent. Have have like a tarp over the back of the car and the tent underneath the tarp, just in case it's raining. So I'm not sure how waterproof my tent is, to be fair. So we'll plan it, we'll sort it out, and. Hopefully it'll be a nice couple hour long video. Hopefully. As if anybody's got a couple hours to spare to watch <laughs> to watch me and Paddy and probably the missus and child go camping. Like I said, it's finding the right place. Lived in Cornwall for 32 years. And I never knew this place existed. Paddy, come up there please. Thank you. You having fun? Hey? Yeah? Go on then. <laughs> well, this walk just got even better. Look at that. Look at this. I'm loving this. Paddy, get out of there, please. Actually, no, you're right. You carry on, you're fun. Are you going to go up that way? Or should we go that way? Do you want to go this way? This bridge, though. That's cool. I think you've lost me and Paddy to the woods, Alex. This place is awesome. We're going to go up that way now. Look at this though. Wow! It's so cool. That is wicked. So glad I come here now. I was looking for ages on my phone for a place to go. Come on. I just seen this one. I was just like, yeah, all right. I'll go and have a check it out. So glad I did. So, so glad I did. So Trelissic was the place that Satnav took me to. Rinkling Lane, 10 minutes, okay. Roundwood Fort and Key. Ooh. But that's over that way. That's we'll leave we'll save that for another day. We'll come down another day and we'll we'll, we'll, we'll visit that. But we'll go this way for a minute. You alright mate? Yeah? You having fun? This is nice, isn't it? Come on then. Let's go. Go. And this is going to be a rather long video because I can't get enough of this. I really can't. This is amazing. You alright, mate? Come on, then. Come on, let's go. Let's go. It's jumping up. It's waiting for a nice opening because it looks like it. Looks out onto um, the River Fowl, I think. I think all oh, this is part of the River Fowl. All this down here. There's a tiny little beach down there. We'll go down there on the beach. What are you sniffing? The girl been there, is it? Come on. And he's still sniffing. <laughs> Paddy, let's go. You can see that through there.
Hi, go on. Paddy, leave it be. Come on, this way. I don't know if you can hear that bird. Not that one. <laughs> Come on. This obviously seems to be a, a key. Or a dock of some sort. There's like a gate in there. I don't know why you'd need a gate for for here, so Let's head back up this way. I'm coming mate, I'm coming. Come on. Right, Paddy. I think we need to start heading back, don't we? I don't want to either, I want to keep going, but Now me and Paddy decided we're going to start heading back. <laughs> One, because a big scary Wattweiler just made me jump. He wasn't really scary, he was really, really friendly. He was really nice. He just snuck up behind me. And two, I'm hungry. <laughs> it's time to go home for some dinner, huh? But no, this place is amazing. But we'll definitely bring you guys along here again, I think. And we'll we'll have a look over that side next time. Go across the bridge and have a look at the fort. Apparently there's a fort over there. That's what it said. So we'll see. Paddy. Paddy. Ooh. Paddy. Totally ignores me when he can smell a girl. I swear it's when he can smell a girl. But no interest in me whatsoever. You smell a girl. Is that it? He's not running. Oh. I'm going to have to watch that back again because I swear he just limped it on his back leg a little bit. All right, Paddy. I think we're going to have to end it there, mate, and get a mooch on. Don't you? Are you going to come say goodbye? Hey? Come here. And say goodbye. Can you sit down? Sit. Always has a shake before he sits down. Anyone else's dog do that? See? Cheers and gone. We'll see you next time. Where should we go next time? Here? Yeah. All right then. Uh, come here. You know the drill. All right, Dad, sit down and cheers and gone. <laughs> See you next time, guys. Cheers and gone.